I'm here at the Barclays Center where the Duquesne Dukes just beat the St. Bonaventure Bonnies with a score of 70 to 60 in their semifinals game. Here are your highlights. Day Day Grant led the Dukes to victory over the Bonnies in game 13 of the A-10 championship. Grant was their leading scorer with 27 points, 12 of which came from three-pointers. Grant made 10 of his 15 shots throughout the game. Jimmy Clark III was the second leading scorer, contributing 18 points for the Dukes. The Dukes took their first lead around three and a half minutes into the game on a three-pointer from Grant. Duquesne remained in the lead from around four minutes into the first half through the end of the game. Monica Barba, the mother of Dukes forward Andy Barba, attributes the team's win to their determination. I think they're hardworking. Uh, you know, they're from a hardworking town, and I think they are gritty, and they, they're, uh, you know, they have their heart in the right place, and when they come together and play together, uh, the game will be theirs. After an upset over Loyola in Thursday's quarterfinals, the Bonnies fought hard to make it through to the championship game. With six and a half minutes left in the game, the Bonnies cut the Dukes' lead to only four points after a three-pointer from Charles Pride, but Duquesne was able to hold them off. Daryl Banks III put 14 points on the board for the Bonnies, but it wasn't enough to emerge victorious over Grant and the Dukes. If the Dukes win the championship, they will make their first appearance in the NCAA tournament since 1977 when they won the first ever Atlantic 10 tournament. The Dukes will take on the VCU Rams tomorrow in the championship game at 1 p.m. For Rambler Sports Locker, I'm Natalie King.